Hello and good day. This is Nathan with Jersey Mail Systems, and this is a video demonstration for the Postbase 20 from FP. Here on the right hand side, you have the envelope catch tray. Here in the center, you have the main postage meter. And on the left side, you have the hand feed for envelopes and labels. On the back right, you're going to have the five pound scale, which is standard with this model. In the front, you're going to have the silver round button, which is your power on and off. Also, we'll take the machine out of sleep mode, as well as the long black button here, which is your screen adjust. You can flip this up depending on the light setting in your office. Behind that, we have a little stylus for the fully screen touchscreen. We're going to go ahead and push this button, take this machine out of sleep mode, and we can get started. Here at the top right, you have your postage currently being used along with the weight. Next to that you have two option buttons here for images also called advertisements. There are some preloaded selections in here. Below those advertisements you have your current date Below that you have your three standard shortcut keys, first class letter, 47 cents, first class large envelope at a dollar, and first class package retail at $3.50, all starting at one ounce. Here you have your product button, where you can do additional type of mailing, many more different types than what you'll have on your shortcut keys such as certified mail, return receipts, insurance, priority mail if you're doing anything over 13 ounces, package servicing, international, or specials, such as redating, correction, or manual postage. Here in your menu button, you have selections for downloading postage. Here in the download postage, your machine should be set and hooked up to an ethernet cord for your internet where you can download uh, money from your account in increments of $10. Hit the load postage button and the machine will reach out to your account and pull that money straight to this meter. Here you have your registers button where you can find your descending value. You can also um, choose to print out on a label or an envelope all this information shown. Here in your print systems button, you can find information about your ink cartridges, how full or how empty they are, what level they're at, percentage. You could also choose to change your cartridges if they get low. This cover on the side will pop open automatically once they move to a change position. The screen will detail how to remove and install old and new cartridges. When you get new cartridges, always replace both that come in the package and dispose of the two that were in the machine previously. When you are finished, you will close the cover gently, allow the machine to calibrate and be cleaned, and the machine will ask you to do an alignment. The alignment is going to be done to make sure that your indicia is straight and printing properly. For this alignment, we're going to use some labels. Place them on the deck, put it towards the back straight, feed it in. It will cross the sensor and the machine will take the label automatically. You will then check your label and you will check the image from the horizontal and vertical line. You will match that image to your screen and if it is not perfectly straight, your machine will automatically adjust it for you until you uh, get it to a number five position, which is a straight line. You may have to do this a couple of times. Once you find that your position is straight, you select straight for horizontal and straight for vertical. Select OK. We'll bring you back to the print systems button menu. You can hit back. You will hit back again to go out of the menu button, back to your main home screen. 
where you can then start printing your mail. Once again, you're going to place your envelope on the hand feed deck. You're going to feed it in so you cross the sensor. The machine will take it automatically and print out your postage. That is your post base 20 from FP. And if you have any questions going further, please feel free to contact us at Jersey Mail Systems.